My name is Ayuna Wankabun, so yeah, I know you're not used to my face. Mm -hmm. But then, I'm here to introduce a show to you. Mm -hmm. I think I can call it a show. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can call it a show. And the name of this show is The Just Arena. That's what it's called, The Just Arena. So here, what we do is we basically chat. That's what we do. We chat. We talk about life-related issues. We talk about relationships. We talk about a whole lot of things. So here, we bring you all the juicy, juicy just. Yeah, that's what we do. And so today, we are going to talk about this topic, office romance. Should I say office romance? No. I think I should make it broad. Let me let me broaden it. Let me broaden it. So we are going to talk about um, whether you think it is healthy to date someone or be with someone who is always in your space. Like let's say in your workplace, in your workplace, someone you're in the same workplace with, someone you are in the same class with in a school setting, or someone you are in the same hood with. Do you think it is healthy? If you think it is healthy, why? If you think it's unhealthy, why? So today, I'm gonna tell you what I think. I'm gonna tell you what I think. But then definitely you will be given the chance to also tell us what you think and then share your experiences with us. Yeah, so I'm gonna tell you what I think. You know, I cannot totally say it's unhealthy. I cannot say that, neither can I say it is healthy. Because either of them, you still have some kind of explanation to do. So, let's say you are dating somebody in your office, and then it doesn't work out. Let's say due to one or two reasons you guys break up. You know, it will be so hard to get over this person, because the person is always there. You go to work every single day and you see this person's face. It will be so, so hard to get over the person it will be difficult for you to move on because you you will always see the person's face and the moment you see the person's face you are you are reminded of whatever the person did to you or whatever you did to the person every single day so personally i think if you were to enter into something like that you should be sure if you're not sure you don't do it that's what I think. If you're not sure, you don't want to enter something like that. That's what I think. But let's sit and say you enter into the relationship, everything works out, you guys are getting married. You know, in some companies, you, you cannot be with your spouse in the same office. You can't be with your spouse in the same office. You One has to resign. Yeah. So in this case, he's going to resign. Is it the guy? Is it the girl? Would you leave your work, I mean your career for the man, or you the man, would you leave your career for the woman? I know a lot of people will say the man is supposed to be providing for the family and also the woman has to live, live her career. But you know, now times are different. Times are very different. We are both trying to build our careers and then you want me to leave mine for you and all. Personally, I don't think I'll do that. I don't think I'll do that. So, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what you will say. I don't know what you think. But that, that is what makes the whole thing a bit complex. Do you get it? That's what makes the whole thing a bit complex. So, I think that if you are willing to enter into something like that, then you have a lot of work to do you will have to deal with a lot of things and trust me all these things are necessary because if you don't deal with them i don't think your relationship will be smooth do you get it you have to deal with them okay so this is what i think i don't think it is so healthy because it has a lot of complications and it is complex yeah it is complex but then if you can deal with all those and then everything will go on fine, then it's okay because people actually do it. People actually do it. I don't have personal experiences though. That is why I am asking you to please and please and please again, share your opinions with me. You can share your opinion by dropping your comments in the comment section. 
you can share your experiences with us by dropping them in the comment section. Or better still, you can DM me on Instagram and then Twitter with your experiences, your views and everything. What you think, everything about it, you can DM me with it. And then I'm going to bring you another late video on Sunday. Yeah, today is Thursday. I'm going to bring you the video on Sunday. So between now and then Sunday, you can bring, you can, you can actually DM me with your views, your experiences, and everything. Or you can drop them in the comment section. I'm going to read them out. We dissect them, and then we talk about a new topic. Yeah, so that's what we're going to be doing on Sunday. So please. Please, I beg you. I know this is supposed to be interactive. I'm supposed to have somebody here. But, you know, because of this pandemic, you cannot really be around people's, um, people. sorry. But then I decided to bring this video to you alone. I know that as time goes on, this pandemic will be over and then we go back to normalcy. So until then, please help me make this as interactive as possible by leaving your comments your experiences and then your views in the comment section or better still dming me on instagram and twitter uh, on twitter with those okay so my instagram handle is irene amankwa bonsu yeah just my name and then on twitter it's irene amankwa bonsu yeah that is it so please i'll be waiting i'll be waiting for them i'll be waiting for your comments i'll be waiting for your experiences because i know most of you have very very juicy and amazing comments and then i would love to read them out yeah so i know you loved this video i know you're already smiling so please give it a thumbs up give it a thumbs up and then subscribe to this channel because this is just the beginning we have a lot more installed for you. Please, please, please again. Don't forget yeah. to follow your girl on Instagram. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter, Irene Amankwa Bunsu. And please leave your comments. I beg you. I beg you. It's very important to me. Thank you for watching today's video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. So until Sunday. I really hate to say this, but then 